Good morning to all and welcome to the session. This session is all about the new course I've just launched. The name of the course, Target SBI Clerk and IBPS Clerk, Exam-Oriented and Student-Centric Course. The features are live lectures, concept-oriented, practice questions, topic-wise tests, mock tests, live explanations. The medium of instruction is English, validity one year, and a time slot every day at 11.30 a.m. The classes are live classes, live online classes. If you take language learners, they are divided into three groups, beginners, intermediate, and advanced. Who are the beginners? Those with rural background or regional language background, it could be Telugu or Tamil or Kannada or Hindi, prefer bilingual teaching. They prefer bilingual teaching. Over a period of time, they master English grammar, but struggle with reading comprehension skill and vocabulary. They find it difficult to read the Hindu newspaper. Intermediate learners, those with rural background or regional language background, a few of them have English medium background, prefer bilingual teaching. They don't mind English to English teaching. Over a period of time, they master English grammar, reading comprehension skill, and vocabulary to a great extent. Initially, they find it difficult to read the Hindu newspaper, but eventually, they make it a habit to read the Hindu newspaper every day. Then we have advanced learners. They have urban background and are convent educated. Prefer English to English teaching, good at English grammar, reading comprehension skill, and vocabulary. Need to fill the gaps here and there. They read the Hindu newspaper, English novels, magazines, etc. For them, English is not a problem. Coming to this course, overview of the course. This course is for beginners and intermediate language learners. It is exam centric as well as student centric. Focus is on general English, which covers grammar, reading comprehension skill, vocabulary, and new patterns. New patterns are very important. Every topic is taught in a systematic way to make sure the concepts are crystal clear. Topic wise tests and mock tests are conducted for consolidation. Syllabus of the course. The syllabus is comprehensive and covers both the basics and the advanced concepts related to grammar, reading comprehension, and vocabulary. Focus is on exam topics and new patterns. Exam topics like error location, sentence improvement, phrase replacement, passage, close test, parrot jumble, scrambled sentences, fillers, new patterns are covered with tips and strategies. What is this exam centric course? I said it is exam centric and uh, or exam oriented and student centric. Different exams call for different approaches. Exam oriented or exam centric approach is learning what is required from a particular exam point of view. You don't go beyond that. Exam centric approach puts one on the right track and enables selection. If you don't do that, you go off the track then your effort and time, they both go waste down the drain. All the efforts are streamlined and a lot of time is saved. Exam sending approach is essential to have the competitive edge and get selected. What is student centric course? Batches are usually heterogeneous. We have students at different levels. In every batch, there are students who are at different levels. Concepts are explained keeping in mind the standards, and the needs of the students. Student centric approach makes it easy to learn and master general English. Course features to be very specific live classes, basic to advanced level, topic wise tests and live explanation, classes and explanation only in English, exam topics, 200 grammar rules, 50 essays based on SLEEP's concept, the Hindu editorial analysis PDFs. How can you enroll? Go to Google Play Store, search for Murthy's English, download the app, 
go to courses, not batches. Purchase the course. How long is it valid? If you miss a live session, you can watch the recorded video and the validity is for one year. You can watch any number of times, one year from the date of joining. What is the difference between offline classes, online classes? Why should you enroll when it comes to enrolling in a particular course? Should it be, do you have to go for online or offline? A quick look, offline one time, online classes many a time. You can watch the videos any number of times and the validity is one year. This is an advantage for beginners and intermediate learners. Specific time, offline classes 10 to 11 or 11 to 12. You can attend the session at a specific time. Online classes any time, that is your choice. Doubts during the offline session, you can ask doubts during the session. Before, after, you cannot. And during the session also only a few doubts. But online, after the session, there's a group you can express or you can ask your doubts, any doubts, any time. Validity, usually offline three months, online one year. And offline, you have to go to a particular place, a town or city, and you can learn from there. But online classes, from anywhere, any part of the country, you can learn. Why with Murthy's 25 years of teaching experience, trained thousands of students, systematic teaching, exam-centric and student-centric approach. If you want to have more details, don't hesitate to call us. The number is 7032325590. Thank you very much. All the best.